how many liters of water is requ are required to dissolve one grams of one gram of barium chromate at 25 uh, degrees Celsius. Molar solubility of barium chromate is 1.10. Okay, this is number six. So I want, I, want, I want to first figure out what is the formula of barium chromate. So I know that barium is Ba here. Barium, this is Ba. It has a 2 plus charge. Ba has a 2 plus. And chromate is actually a polyatomic. So chromate, I know that it's CrO4. And it also has a 2 minus charge here. It's one of those polyatomic guys here. So barium chromate would be my chemical formula is Ba. CrO4. And this here is my chemical formula for barium chromate. And I want how many liters of water are required to dissolve one gram, one gram of barium chromate here. So in order for me to do this, um, I need to figure out the molar solubility of barium chromate first. So I need to find the KSP of barium chromate. So let me Google that. And I will get I have KSP at um, 25 degrees so this is ksp would be uh, 1.17 times 10 to the negative 10. Um, and this here says barium chromate in water is 1.1 times 10 to the negative 5. so i don't know where they're getting this kind of uh, ksp value but i think their ksp value is wrong already um, I'm taking my KSP table from this guy here. So if you look at our kind of KSP solubility product constants here, um, we're looking at barium chromate here. So barium chromate is this guy here. It's 1.2 times 10 to the negative 10 here. And they should give you this in, uh, in, your, in your test here. So immediately this answer is already wrong because molar solubility here is already wrong here. So in this case, I have, uh, I have this KSP value here. And what I want to do now is I want to convert these grams into moles, right? So I have one gram of barium chromate. And then I have also uh, the molar mass. I have to find the molar mass of barium chromate, right? So let me, let me figure that out for you. So this here, I want moles equals mass over molar mass. The moles is going to equal one gram divided by our molar mass of barium chromate, which is, let's see, BA has a molar, uh, has 137.33 as the, as our molar mass here. So it's 137.233 plus our, our molar mass of chromium, which is 51.996 plus four times our oxygen here, which is 15.999, right? So this will equal Take out my calculator, 1 divided by 137.33 plus 51.996 plus 4 times 15.999. This is going to equal 3.94 times 10 to the negative 3 here. So let's see. I don't, let's see if they got moles here. I don't even think they got moles here actually. Um, so I don't know if they got the question right. So it's here, I would, I would have gotten 3.95 times 10 to the negative three moles. And now I have the moles of barium chromate. What I can do now is I can figure out, um, figure out, uh, using my, I write, write down, write down my KSP kind of value here, right? So I'm, what I can do here is I can... Let's see, I want, the I want the volume, right? Okay, so I have 3.95 times 10 to the negative three moles. And I'm, I'm just trying to check their solution here. It's kind of weird. It says take, one point, take the KSP value and divide it by the molar mass of barium chromate. But they're multiplying the barium. But, so this doesn't really make sense here. So to take one gram, okay, so I have 2.787 times 10 to the negative three grams per liter. So this is a, this is a, this is the um, density of this actually, grams per liter. And I want to figure out how many liters of water. This is 2.78 ppm here. So I don't know what they're trying to solve here. 
So the solution is definitely incorrect here. I'm just figuring out how do I, where they went wrong here. Um, let's see. So what I can do is I can, if I want to actually solve this problem by myself, I can um, I can basically write down the chemical reaction, right? So BACRO4 is going to dissociate into BA plus or BA2 plus and CRO4 2 minus here, right? And I know the moles of this is 3.95 times 10 to the negative 3 moles. And what I want to do is I want to find the find the molar solubility. Oh, the molar solubility is 1.10 actually. So, um, or it's 1.10 times, I think it's 1.10 times 10 to the negative something. And I think that's what they were trying to solve for here. But they, I think it's cut off or something. So they didn't actually give me the answer here. Um, let's see. So they have 1.1 times 10 to the negative five. I don't, moles per liter. This is our molarity. Is this what, oh, I think this is what this is actually. So they actually give you the concentration, which is 1.10 times 10 to the negative five. Okay. I think I know, I think I know what they're doing here now. So this here is our moles. It's very, very hard when like stuff like this gets like cut out, cut out. It's very, very hard for me to actually decipher what they're trying to do here. So 1.1 times 10 to the negative five molarity. And then I'm going to multiply it by, uh, or I can divide it by um, our moles here to figure out what our volume is going to be here, right? So here's volume. So I know that again, N equals C over V, or sorry, C equals N over V. So if I want to calculate my volume, it's going to be moles divided by our concentration. So I have 3 point, 3 point 3.95 times 10 to the negative 3 divided by this 1.10 times 10 to the negative 5. It's going to give me the volume, which is 359. 359 liters here. And as you can see, this here, answering liters to three significant digits is 359. So I will round it to 359 liters. So this solution here is correct. 359 here is correct. And I believe they have 359 as well. So this solution is correct, but they like I, the question was cut off. So I couldn't actually see what the, it's 1.1 times 10 to the negative five is our kind of answer. So I'm gonna say solution is correct. Uh, question was mislead. Question is missing, missing, missing information here. Missing information. Um, and I'm going to say, so basically more solubility of barium chromate is 1.10 times 10 to the negative 5 um, here. And then we can solve it here. But let me just, uh, let me just write this down here. So I can say, moles of barium chromate would equal one gram divided by uh, the molar mass here, which is 137.33 grams per mole plus 51.996 grams per mole plus four times 15.999 grams per mole which would equal 3.95 times 10 to the negative three moles of barium chromate. We say volume of barium chromate would be equal to um, moles of barium chromate divided by our concentration or molar solubility. Which will equal, copy and paste this guy here, divided by our molar solubility, which is 1.10 times, oh, times 10 to the negative five M, which would give us our volume which is 359. Therefore, we would need uh, 359 liters of water.
to dissolve um, one gram of barium from it. So there's a solution that's correct, but they just had it really, really poorly um, outlined here. Thank <laughs> you.